A rare polio-like syndrome may be in West Michigan. There are 155 cases reported across the country, and now a possible case has shown up in Ottawa County in a child. The CDC now working to confirm. It's one of four possible cases in Michigan. Three kids and one adult male in Ottawa, Ingham, Macomb, and Oakland counties. 24 Hour News 8's Heather Walker joins us now with what you need to know about AFM. Heather? Yeah, there's still a lot of mystery surrounding this, but AFM is described as polio-like because it causes a similar weakness in your arms and legs. The symptoms develop quickly. Rare but serious. At this point, that's the best way to describe AFM or acute flaccid myelitis. Nobody's been able to identify the cause yet, although it is still suspected that it may be a virus that we just don't know about yet. According to the CDC, AFM affects a person's nervous system, specifically the spinal cord, causing weakness in one or more limbs. There could be a variety of causes, such as viruses or an environmental toxin. The symptoms have a sudden onset. They include muscle weakness in the arms or legs, drooping eyelids, difficulty swallowing, or slurred speech. And why do you think we're seeing this now? We don't know much about this. According to the chief medical executive of Michigan Department of Health and Human Services, AFM is not new to Michigan. It first showed up in 2014. There were a couple of cases reported over the past four years, but in the past few weeks, four possible cases have popped up in our state. AFM is not known to be contagious, and so far it has been non-fatal. For some reason, it pops up in the fall, and why some people get it and others don't is still infected. unknown. We have not been able to identify a certain group of people or people with any certain underlying conditions that seem to be more at risk than others. Yeah, as you can see, still lots of questions surrounding this. The best way to avoid getting it at this point, wash your hands, get your vaccines, also protect yourself against mosquito bites, and make sure you're getting enough sleep. Brian Marley.